Mark, long discussions with both groups. Could you characterize what was said and what you were looking for as a board of control and, 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 and what you wanted to hear out of these two cities? Well, we're, we're looking for a place to rent. And, and because of uh, uh, what happened with, with Madison at, at this at this moment, and things might change, we need to sit and really evaluate what would be the best experience for our, number one, our athletes and, and for the fans that follow them. What does the word today that the Big Ten may reconsider the hockey do to the to the urgency of this discussion? It, it really, I think, in my opinion, and a couple other board members, again, collectively will make the decision, is that if they go to a neutral site that would uh, potentially free up the coal center, which is the most of us think is the most desirable site to go to. So what do you do in the meantime? Do you have a, is a, was a lot of this developing a contingency plan in case that doesn't happen? Uh, right now, and we really haven't sat down and discussed it, I think we're going to take a couple minutes here and, and uh, formulate a, a plan of action with uh, Executive Director Anderson is to, number one, kind of soak in what was just what we've just been presented. Uh, it's not very uh, bright for us to make a rash decision. Uh, sit down, talk, communicate, and probably reconvene the board in one matter or the other, either bring us all back or a teleconference and, and make a decision. And uh, as far as, you know, the two cities, you personally, what did you like about what you heard? Well, you know, I, I, I I like both cities, and, and again, each of the board members uh, represents a different part of the state. You know, myself being from the Northwest, a lot of our folks are, are from my area, our, our cultural center is Minneapolis, St. Paul, and Madison. You know, we have a lot of Packer fans who enjoy going over to Green Bay, and, and, and my experience at the volleyball tournament has been nothing but positive. So uh, I can honestly say that most of us are, are unbiased at this moment. I, if you look at the tradition of, of, of Madison and how great they've been to us, uh, you know, with the state capital, fine university, you know, it, it's, it's a good place to have it. Green Bay has many positives. Lambeau Field, a lot of people sometimes forget they have a nice university there too. So it, it's going to be a very tough decision. And, and the board certainly feels knows the importance of this decision to so many people in the country. You know, the board's really never had to make a decision like this before. We don't have any precedent to follow to move a, a signature venue from one place to another. So, you know, you have to take a lot into consideration, not only the, just the facilities and, and what the communities have to offer, but uh, uh, the hotels, the restaurants, availability, parking. You know, it, it's, it's, it's almost overwhelming. So I, I have full confidence in our executive staff. They've worked extremely hard and done a great amount of research and then uh, the members of the board know, know the, uh, you know, our, our decision will have a bearing on one community or the other. To use a basketball term, it sounds like Green Bay put the full court press on you guys. I mean, they're talking, and did that surprise you? I mean, they're talking about, you know, outside events and, and you know, cooperation of, you know, numerous hotels, et cetera, that, that really involving the whole community. It, it, it you know, I, I think it might have the advantage because being a smaller community, it can, can embellish everyone else, you know, with the Packers and, and the other communities in the Fox River Valley. Um, you know, Madison is unique in the aspect of, you know, you can go outside and, um, you know, people just love going up and down State Street and go visit the Capitol. Um, you know, just the beauty of the zoo and some of those other places that might be open. You know, it's... You know, so people go down and watch basketball games, but they also like to experience what, what a community has. For some of the folks that go to the state tournaments, the only time their school goes, so they really want a total, total experience of the community.